So in the world of digital marketing, there's a lot of absolutes. Should I do this? Should I do that? I should do just SEO. I should do just blogging. Well, there are no absolutes. So today we're going to talk about what is the role of SEO in your digital marketing strategy? What works and what doesn't? So when you're sitting down and making your plans for 2019 into 2020, you're going to get a lot of things put on the table. You're going to have SEO, blogging, website, and social, and maybe some other things that you want to throw in there like podcasting. The problem is, is like as a business owner, like how do we figure out how much time to put it and where? So I want to take a step back and talk to you about what's most important and how do you distribute it? So the most important thing you can do as a business owner is to get those great ideas out of your mind and onto paper. So a couple things that we've been doing is we just sit down, we open up a recorder on our laptop or a recording app, and I interview the clients on a concept. So let's say I'm gonna interview a client on keyword research tools. I pull up in Google keyword research tools. I've got it right in front of me and I start asking questions of the person who I'm interviewing. Now remember, I'm recording this the whole time. Between three and five minutes will give you about 900 words. Now this is really important because now, in less than 10 minutes, I've been able to get a 900 word document from you, the thought leader. And then I take it to a transcription service like revrev.com and I have it transcribed. And within minutes, I get the transcription of the audio. Then we take that content and we send it off to our social media people, our bloggers, and our podcast or whatever we want to use that to distribute it. Take an ownership of that piece because that's what your expertise is. Then when you're looking at a digital marketing strategy, you say, okay guys, here's my one piece. So then your social media company slices and dices that into social media posts or Instagram stories. Then that same piece gets written up in a blog with images then that same piece becomes a topic for your podcast. And you talk about that with an expert in the industry. So I don't want you to think about how many different things do I have to do? I want you to think about being a thought leader on one topic and then you give that to the vendors in your life, your social media, your bloggers, your content writers, let them take it and repurpose it like crazy. A good digital marketing strategy has to start with an excellent piece of content. And then once you record yourself, you could be driving to work, you could be, I don't know, on your own at home and you just want to dictate or walk around the, the apartment or walk around your office, have a sticky note with three or four keyword ideas and just talk about them for five to six minutes. You're going to get a ton of content, have it transcribed, then hand it off to the vendors in your life. This is what you should be focusing on from a digital marketing strategist. You are the expert. You are the professor. Take the time to pick one concept that you're an expert in and record yourself. Then let the experts in your life figure out how to slice and dice it, repurpose it so that you can get everyone on every social media channel. That is a real digital strategy based on search engine optimization, keywords that you want to be findable for, but then you take your vision, your voice as an expert, and you create the content that matters. That's what turns a digital marketing strategy into something that works and something that falls flat. Do it right. A good digital marketing strategy is just the tip of the iceberg. My book, Marketing Espionage, how to spy on yourself, your prospects and your competitors to dominate online is the ultimate guide in an easy, non-technical format on how to become the most findable business online. It lays out your whole strategy as well as talks about implementation tactics that are easy for you to apply that will make you infinitely more findable. Check us out on Amazon. Love to have you give some comments. If you've read the book or you've got questions about a digital marketing strategy, please comment below. I watch those comments and I will definitely get back to you and give you some good feedback regarding what you post below. Hey, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell so that you get notifications every day of my new findability videos.